how to disassemble the fuser unit of Xerox version 3100 press. Component pull out. Then take the one word screwdriver. Please refer this location. At the same time, the other hand is pulled out, same way on the other side. Hold and pull out the assembly. Remove the housing first. Then remove the flywheel. Take it off and put it away. Unplug the second BTR cable. Remove the screws for the second BTR. Bring this up. Hold both hands at the same time. Just raise it up. After bringing it up, Put it together with the components just disassembled. Then remove the front cover of the fuser unit. Remove the screws, this location. This location. This location. This screw here. Fuser unit removed. Hold this position with one hand. Hold this position with one hand. Take it out. Put it underground if you need to remove the internal fuser film. You need to remove this screw first. Fuser film screws are here, and there are also Fuser film After taking it, put off. the screw here, cover plate open This component is fuser film Unplug these three sockets Unplug Now take down the fuser film Move this this way and lay it flat like this. Okay. Remove the blade. Remove these two springs first. Then take this blade off. After taking it off, then find a screwdriver. Find two screws. Then hold down with your hand. Put the screw in this position. Clamping. Here too. Clap here. Hold. Then stand this up. Put it back and lay it flat like this. General maintenance this fuser film. It is to apply silicone oil on it. Brush the two sticks above a little bit. Then brush this brush a little too. This white brush. Yes, and then put this. This brush is also brushed with some silicone oil. Then you can put it back in the tropics. Place the belt on both sides and leave a little bit on each side. Then lay it flat like this. Remove the first screw placed. There is another screw. Reinstall the blade. This is a blade. Buckle spring.
put this back on. Then plug this plug in. Let's cover this up. Just cover it. No brute force required. It can be installed gently. Install the screws. Hold both ends of this position and put it back. Then put back the fixing screws. Then put this component back in. Plug it in. Install the screws. Install the cover. Install the flywheel. Just install the shell. Flip the switch. There are switches on the left and right sides. Push back. Close the door. Okay.